Hi, inspirational dude with one minute of inspiration. The first step to living an inspired life is I for imagination. You are your imagination. Now think about that. Whatever you do, whether it's going to work, going to school, going to a meeting, going shopping, the first thing you do is imagine how do you want to look, how do you want to present yourself, even when you're with family. So your imagination leads you to become who you are. It's also the thing that separates us from animals. When I think about it, that is the major difference, is that animals don't go around imagining things. I'm assuming this, I'm pretty sure they don't. But we do, we can imagine anything we want, and what we imagine we become. We cannot achieve anything unless we see it. It's like when you think about a lemon and you bite into it, and you can imagine the taste. You know, if someone just says bite into a lemon, an imaginary one, you would feel the taste. So pictures creates the feeling, and that becomes your power, your energy. It is the powerhouse of living an inspirational life. So think about what you want to imagine yourself to be. Also, the imagination doesn't come from any physical parts of our body. Scientists can't prove, you know, which part of the brain it comes from. They do have some theories, but basically, imagination is spirit. It is something that has been given to us to imagine, to create it. Everything that you see now was once imagined. So imagine your life, imagine your day, imagine your relationships, imagine your finance, imagine the man or woman of your dreams, imagine everything and make it happen. Cheers, one minute of inspiration, love.